the latest draft in the powered plugins. <laughs> Introduction. Introduce myself. I am Shogo Matsushita. I am Beam on Neo Beam Patches plugins author. And I am one of Beam JP member. This is my old work for Beam or Neo Beam. My Beam career is 2008 to 2024. I have contributed for many completion related features. For example, completed item, get the completion, etc. And I have developed many plugins. For example, Neo Compercash, Unite, Neo Bundle, et, et cetera. And later, Deoprit, Denied, DefX, Dying, et cetera. I talk about real minimal plugins. Gain the freedom to configure your plugin. This is common scenario. The author creates the simplest and many more plugin. The later the number of users increases. But the author cannot accept the user request or the plugin lose its simplicity due to the added features. Oh, what went wrong? Regarding the current minimal plugins, uh, it, they are minimal configuration or easy to use? No, they are minimal only for the authors. They are not minimal for other users. The why current minimal plugins are not minimal for other users? Because the minimal means that there are no unnecessary features. People have different environments and minimal features. That's why you need to configure. Uh, why don't you configure plugins? You prefer minimal configuration plugins? You have tired of configuring plugins? You have not time to configure? <sighs> Please remember this from today's presentation. Your time exists to be used for the text editor. Please see the engineer Rock M. Beam JP Radio. The time spent using the text editor is free because time spent on anything other than text editor is wasted. The text editor is not meant to an end in life, but an end in itself. I think the real minimal programs are configure or yourself and it's extensible. And don't work if you don't install or configure plugins. And no side effects. And decoupling of implementation. Hi, this is the minimal configuration plugin example. Bring CMP is minimal configuration because the configuration is almost bring set up almost one line. Oh, it's minimal configuration, okay. The next, this is a real co minimal configuration plugin example, DDC. It needs to be set UI option as sources and Matcher and sorter. And finally, you need to enable DDC plugin by covering DDC enable 
function. I think commonly used plugins are too user friendly. Users are right and over science. Users understand their own configuration. Copy pasting setting is unex unacceptable. Question. So you need to study plugins before use? Answer is of course, yes. Please, please remember yourself. Didn't you study BIM when you started using it? You haven't executed BIM tutorial? I think it feels uncomfortable when plugins work without any configuration. It, it, it works with any configuration, without any configuration. It's magic. It's too, too user-friendly. It's not user-friendly. You need to configure anything. The world is full of configuration. You're creating your own plugins or uh, on text editors using plugin distributions Space Beam or Lazy Beam, or using Nix or Arch Linux, or et cetera. Or install plugins. Isn't saying, I don't want to configure. The same as saying, I don't want to breast. <laughs> this is my plugin development policy. I want to fulfill the wishes of all plugin users. I don't consider users who don't want to configure their plugin. I need minimal reproducible bug report to fix bugs. And I don't define default mappings. And I don't define no I don't define any commands. Hi. The scan, I talk about the latest Dirk Dino Power plugins. Be awakened to the text editor. Oh, so what means Dirk? Press C, help, design not. I have defined it is the right way. The right way is BIM is not OS or shell or terminal. BIM is not same with Emacs. BIM is not everything. Okay, okay. This is the right way. So the dark way is BIM is OS or shell or terminal. BIM is same with Emacs. BIM is everything. There are the latest Dirk Dean Power plugins. DDC is auto completion plugin. DDU is user interface plugin. DPP is plugin manager. The plugins are built on Dean Power technology, Dinopus Beam. For Dinopus Beam, press zero. RSS BIMCon tiny presentation. They are configurable using TypeScript. You can configure plugin per TypeScript. It means you can use the type information. This is TypeScript configuration example. My. My, um, it can UI or sources and matches sorters can can be can be set by TypeScript. And it they can extensible using TypeScript. You can create the extension by TypeScript. Press C DDC source, DDU source, DPP, EXT, source code. They have not side effect. 
It means they don't work if you don't configure plugins. If you install side effect plugin, you may get unknown sound from Beam. Please see the topics. It's a Pascon から中国語が急に再生され困った。You can see the side effect. And the plugin does not don't define default mappings. It means you can define your original mappings. You don't need to know what is the default mappings. You don't need to disable the default mappings. You don't worry about plugin conflicts. And they don't define any commands. It means you can define your original commands. I think function is better for me than commands. The, but the commands wrapper is available for DDU. And decoupling of implementation. It means you can use only use the enabled features that you need. You don't need to worry about what features are installed because you need to install only what you need. The question, the plugins are complex? No, because this config configuration is really simple. You just need to configure everything. It's fun. But the plugins can fulfill any user's wishes. If you're trying to make the plugin do complex things, will make the configuration complicated. The conclusion, the dark DIN powered plugins are real minimal plugins. Your time exists to be used for the text editor. You need to study BIM and plugins. Uh, this is additional information. I have created DDT. This is Dirk Dean Terminal Interface for Beam Neo Beam. It's the next of Beam Shell and Dell. But it's under construction. It does not work well. You can support the real minimal plugin development. This is my GitHub sponsor page. And the progress and issues are welcome. Thank you for your attention. And <laughs> Thank you for your configuration. We have five minutes. <laughs> so, <laughs> are there any question? Anybody there? You? Hmm? Are there any えー、まず、えー、正吾さん、いつもあの素敵なダークパウダーなプラグインをありがとうございます。いつも設定させていただきありがとうございます。<笑><笑>えっと、正吾さんは多分あの長い期間ビームとまあネオビームに関わり続けて、あのいろんなこうプラグインの設計思想みたいなものをこう築き上げて今回のセッションになったのかなと思っていますが、えっ、ー、と。今のあの DDU だったり DDC だったり、まあ今 DTP もありますが、なんか今後新しいプもしプラグインを、まあ今今 DDT を多分使えていると思いますが、新しいプラグインを作るとなったときに、なんかこういうふうにしてみたいとかなんかそういう構想とかあったりしますか？こういうふうにしてみたい。まあこういうふうにしてみたいっていうのは、まあ大体もう固まってしまっているので、うん、そうですね。まあ、自分の作,作るプラグインを、まあ、設定可能にするっていう感じですかね。<笑>うん、<笑>なんなんなん
、うんまあ、古いプラグインはやはり古い思想に基づいていてちゃんと設定可能になっていなかったりデフォルト設定が大量に存在していたりするのでちょっとあれは何とかしたいなとは思っているところです。それはあの過去にまあ作成された例えばユナイトだったりまあデナイトだったりっていうプラグインもまあデフォルト設定というものをすべて外してあのすべて設定させていただくことができるということで大丈夫でしょうかああそうなんですよでそれが DDU なんですよね<笑>はいまあ要するにえとユナイトやデナイトをまあ設,定設定可能にしたすべて設定可能にしたのが DDU。いやとても大変なあの作業だと思いますがあの、はい、ありがとうございました、はい、いつも設定させていただきありがとうございます、はい、<笑><笑> OK we have more time と素敵な発表ありがとうございますえっとあの今の DDC とかその DDU とのそのプラグインがその省吾さんの作られているプラグインの中でいわばその最新版だと思うんですけれどもその DDU、DDC あのもうリリースされてからえっと割とその時間が経っているかと思うんですがあのこのプラグインらについてももっとこうすればよかったなみたいなところってあるんでしょうかうんどうだろう、まあ、当時はベストを尽くしたと思っていたけれどうん難しいところですね。もうちょっと改善できるところがあればしたいところであるんですけど、まあ、パフォーマンスとか、えーとまあ、内,内部の設計周りとかはもうちょっとどうにかならないかという部分は、まあまあ、あるんですけど、まあ、機能的には不満はないかな、うん、っていうところですかね。ありがとうございます。はい、OK です。Thank you for your questions and thank you for your presentation again.、はい